Hi everyone, Jim with CD Nova again, and today we're looking at the Thermoscientific PDR1000 particulate monitor. So this is a personal particulate monitor, very portable, very easy to carry around. This is just the front of the unit, the side, the back, and back to the other side and the front. And this unit uh, has a pump inside, measures particulate, it's a light scattering source. Um, air is simply pulled in through the top of this unit, just in, just in underneath of this lip right here. So there's a air intake on this side, and another air intake on the other side, right underneath here. So it can be, you know, you can leave it outside, and it's uh, like a rain on the top. It won't bother this unit. Uh, the air intakes are on the front and the back, and it uh, reports uh, particulate for dust and good for smoke as well. Uh, so this unit has a rechargeable battery pack module for extended life, extended operation. It can also take a 9 volt DC battery inside, in the bottom here. And it can have an external battery pack as well, uh, an external battery adapter, sorry, as a DC voltage adapter that you plug into AC and convert to DC as well. So there's three ways of uh, getting power to this unit. The uh, battery pack, the 9 volt battery, or the uh, AC to DC adapter module for this unit. Um, to turn this unit on, just simply hold the on button. Show the start, zero, enter. If you want to do a zero for this unit. Uh, if you want to go to run right away, go to run, so just press next. Uh, start run, start run, press enter. Or ready next, go through the menus. So if we just go enter on this unit, down here, it will go, it says logging disabled, if not the logging, the data logging is turned off right now, it's just simply a menu selection if you want to turn it on, uh, and then it starts reporting right away, it says uh, concentrations in uh, cubic meters, and time weighted average, also in cubic meters, so it gives you two, uh, two lines of your data on this display, and to stop the unit, you can just simply Exit, it says terminate run, uh, if you yes, you just press enter, no, exit, so if I want to terminate, I'll just hit enter, there, and it says start run, or exit, and back to the turn off the PDR, so if you want to turn this unit off, you just simply hit yes for enter, It's off. So we'll turn it back on. Power on off button. Start run. Enter. Go to run next. If we hit the next button, we'll start to go through some of the menu items. Start run. Enter. Ready next. Logging is uh, is disabled. I can turn it on. So log interval five seconds. You can get a bit an ID tag. My alarm is off. I can give it an alarm setting. Analog out, 0 to 400. Analog output. Next, well, it is the cal factor of 1. Averaging time of 2 seconds. My battery left is 32%. Memory is 99%. Clear. And I can connect it to a PC to download the data. And go back to start, run, enter. So if I just press enter on this unit, it shows me the log interval every five seconds. And it starts to sample right away. Concentration, see it's just like 0 0.38. Concentration and the TWA is pretty close trending, 0 0.36, 0.36, sorry. So very simple unit, very compact, very easy to operate. I want to turn it off, press enter, and that way I can show you what the uh, the battery pack on the bottom here. Is. So this, on if you look at the back of the unit, it actually has some labeling on it to explain what some of these ports are. This is a digital COM port 
alarm output and has an arrow pointing up. So if I turn this unit, you can see the port to the phone jack. And that's what that is. That's the analog output, zero to five volts, zero to four to 20 milliamp output off this port right here. There's a belt clip mount. These two nuts here, you can have a belt clip mount attached to here. So we'll walk around with this unit. It explains where the battery, nine volt battery compartment is. It's just in underneath this, uh, this lip here. And then there's an external DC power, uh, seven volts uh, power adapter you can plug in under here as well. And it's explained on the back. It's permissible, permissible real-time dust monitor. Model PDR1000AN. That's what this unit is called. And this module on the bottom is a rechargeable battery module, and you can pull this off and see what's going on underneath. So this is where the 9-volt battery will go. If you want to run it with just a 9-volt battery, if you have the DC power adapter, you can plug it into here. And this hole here just simply lines up with the battery pack. So this is the battery, the external battery pack option you can get for longer run life. This unit. Just has a screw to tighten in so you can screw it to the bottom of the uh, PDR1000 AN. Here's the power adapter port. So a good, uh, a good option to have if you're running it for long periods of time throughout the day. This is uh, this power, power pack. And this is again, looking at the bottom, the back, and then the front of this PDR1000AN from Thermal Scientific. Very, very good portable particulate monitor. And you plug the power adapter back in, power pack, go on, back on again, enter, exit, so we did the, uh, the zeroing function when I turned that first on, enter, Run next, start run enter, and we start sampling right away here. Log in disabled, and we're concentration and time weighted average again. So that's the PDR 1000 AN. Any questions? Feel free to comment. Thank you.